Now it's time to have a little bit of fun in the kitchen. We all love cupcakes, and here to show us a wonderful recipe is Candace Nelson from Sprinkles Cupcakes. Welcome to the show. Thank you so much. I'm so happy to be back. Looks yummy. What are we making today? We are making special peanut butter chip cupcakes. And I'm so excited to share this with you today because I've actually never divulged this recipe before. <laughs> so we get the scoop? You, you're getting the inside scoop, you and your viewers. So Can't wait. What, uh, it all looks good. What all goes in this? So let me show you. We have unsalted butter, granulated sugar, all-natural peanut butter. Here we have dark brown sugar, two eggs, dark uh, semi-sweet chocolate chips, all-natural vanilla, whole milk, baking powder, kosher salt, and of course, all-purpose flour. All right, well, how do we get started well, on this? First, we wanna put our butter and our sugars in the mixer and get that cranked up. And if you wouldn't mind cracking those eggs for me, Lisa, that'd that would be really do. helpful. Can people order these wonderful cupcakes online? If they're not so close to a California store? Well, we bake fresh every day, so we're not shipping our freshly baked cupcakes. Because that's kind of the point. You that's kind of the point. We want you to make the pilgrimage to the store. But you can uh, buy our dry mixes online or at our stores or at Williams-Sonoma. So we're getting the butter and sugar creamed. And then we want to add those eggs that you cracked. Do we have... I'm gonna, do I need to just throw them in? Yeah, just throw them in. Okay. Sake of TV time. There you go. Okay. And then... Make sure that's all blended. And then we want to add our liquid ingredients together. And if you wouldn't mind putting all of our dry ingredients together, I'm going to get the peanut butter in here. And let me tell you, Lisa, the secret to these cupcakes is you want to use all natural peanut butter. What's the difference? Well, at Sprinkles, we're really committed to all natural premium ingredients, no trans fat. So you're all looking at hydrogenated oil. You want to stay away from those icky trans fats. Mm -hmm. So go for the all natural peanut butter. The ingredient list should literally be roasted peanuts and salt. And let me tell you, these cupcakes are not for the faint of heart. You saw how much peanut butter I Yay. put in there. You're about <laughs> to see how many chocolate chips we're putting in here. I mean, these are. If you're going to do it, you need to do it right. Just correct? do it right. They're rich, they're satisfying. Um, and insanely good. I'm sure. And I'm sure. sort of that balance of the sweet and salty mm -hmm. of the peanut butter and the chocolate, it's so good. It's a high end Reese's. It's a high end Very Reese's. High end. Mm -hmm. I just think peanut butter and chocolate is so irresistible. It's a wonderful, wonderful combination. And then we're just going to fold You're the putting all those in there. I'm How many cupcakes are we talking about making here? Just a dozen. And okay. for, you know, one so or two people. So bad. You can have a lot of chocolate. So we're just going to fold in the chocolate chips here. And then we're going to scoop into our. Baking pan, oh, and I think I which have is already lined here. over here, and you can help me scoop too. This would be so much fun to do. With oh, it's kids. so much fun to do with kids. And you know what? The best part about baking these at home is you can eat them when they're still warm out of the oven, and the chocolate chips are melty. Oh, see, that's Un what I'm talking about. Unreal. How much are we trying to fill these up? Oh, just you way? know, fill the scoop, and you're just gonna, you know, fill all of the twelve baking liners up. Women. How long, what temperature and how long are we baking? You're preheating the oven at 350 degrees, and you're going to bake for about 20 minutes. You're looking for the cupcakes to be just kind of toasty brown mm -hmm. on top. And actually, for the sake of TV, sure. we have some already <laughs> I love that. magic of TV already <laughs> baked. And so that's what oh, you're looking for, toasty brown, perfectly puffed. They look like a, like a chocolate chip cookie on the top. And I don't know that we have time to make the frosting today. What goes in the frosting? But the frosting is, again, a really super decadent mix of all-natural peanut butter, confectioner's mm -hmm. sugar, all-natural vanilla, and a touch of salt. Um, my show, so I'm going to lick right out of the bowl. And keep in mind, peanut butter is high in protein. Mm -hmm. And you've got the antioxidants in the dark chocolate chips. So this is power food. <laughs> I love how we can rationalize that cupcakes um, are good for us, but it sounds like maybe they really are. Hey, I'm not telling you need to eat the whole dozen, but one <laughs> will give you enough energy to get through the afternoon. And so I'd love your help frosting as well. We've got an extra spatula over here. This is going to be so now good. Now that we're, uh, you know, hands deep in the frosting, mm -hmm. we also at Sprinkles this summer are launching frozen frosting shots. We've taken our frosting shots and frozen them, and they taste just like gelato. It's amazing. Oh. <laughs> so if you are not in the mood for baking, just stop by one of the bakeries and pop one of those. Yummy. All right, coming up next, we've got eco-friendly products for all you moms out there.